Hello, Joshua. <laughs> Hello. Nice to meet you. Where are you from? You look like you're from Sweden or Norway. Switzerland. Switzerland? Yes. Sweden, Switzerland, same thing. No, 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 no. <laughs> Switzerland no? is in the south. Okay. Yeah. So, you had some questions for me. Yeah, I wanted to ask, yeah. uh, are you sure when you are dying that you come to the paradise? Okay. Being sure, there's two questions. Yeah. Am I sure that when I die, there is God? Yes, I have no doubt. Yeah. Am I sure that I'm going to go paradi paradise? No, I'm not sure. I don't know. Okay. So this question is even, it's not a matter of being certain. It's a matter of being certain that God exists. It's a matter of being certain that you have you done the best you can. Yeah. Because nobody knows where they're going to end up. Yes, we are told that Allah says in the Quran, in al Muslimina wal Muslimati, wal Mu'minina wal Mu'minati, wal Qanitina wal Qanitati. It goes on. The, uh, the believing, uh, the Muslim man and the Muslim woman, the believing man and the believing woman, the obedient man and the obedient woman, and etc. etc. Uh -huh. It says that they will have gardens of paradise. So Allah describes the people of paradise those who are truthful, those who are obedient, you know, those who give in charity, those who fast. My job is to do the actions I can. And I leave the rest to God. If I stand in front of him, I'll say, God, this is the best I did. We don't, we only enter paradise by the mercy of God. Mercy of God. So this doesn't mean, because there's two extremes. Some people say, if it's by the mercy of God, why do you need to fast and pray and give in charity? Why? The point is this. I do all of that because I believe it needs to be done. But my actions are not going to be the ultimate reason I'm going to end up in paradise. It's by God's mercy. So I believe God exists. I believe there's a hereafter. Paradise, hopefully, inshallah, you'll be there as well. So yeah. Do you believe in God? Yeah, I believe in God. Okay, that's good. So yeah. are you, are you, are you, are you, what, what religion do you belong to? I believe in Jesus and in God, in the Bible. Okay, so you're a Christian? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So now, what, so now do you believe... I have a short problem. I have to put my luggage here. It's just one minute. Yeah, sure, I'll sure. Back. Should I go get it? Oh, you go get it. Go get it. Okay, sorry. Okay. Because go, go you will leave. I come... I'm waiting, minute. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Yes. So yeah, so now the question I was going to ask is, um, do you believe God is the all-knowing? Yeah. Like the all-powerful? Yeah. Okay. So now, what makes you believe? Do you believe Jesus is the, the son of God or God? Uh, in the Bible says that this is the same. He is the son of God, yes, yes. but he is also God, yeah. Okay. How could, but he is one with okay, God. Okay, okay. How could, okay. Which one, can, can, the, can Jesus, the God Jesus, can he do what the Father does? Yes. Or is there certain things he can't do? Uh, he can all the things because God give him the poverty. Yeah. Okay, but can is there so every so whatever the Father does, can Jesus do the same? Or is there some things that he can't do that only the Father can do? He can do all things, yeah. So, so Jesus can but do everything the Father can do? Like everything the Father can do, Jesus can do? Or Now, yes, when he was in earth, there were some parts. Uh, there is one scripture, he said, just the Father knows when he come back. So when he was on earth, he didn't know all. But now... Okay, one second. But now so, he knows so, all, no, yeah, okay, and second. he can all. Can, 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 can God know something sometime and not know something sometime? God, no, uh, but Jesus, he came as a human in a person on earth. So uh, he make him himself small in a human. So some rights of him and some knowledge he give up just for this time when he was on okay, earth. Okay, do you think that is a God's attribute? How can God be God if he can give up his power? How can, okay, if God, if God says, okay, I want to give away all my power and be powerless, can God do that? 
Not all, but... Oh, okay, but wh why not all? Okay, if God has infinite power, how could God give away some of his power away and keep some, and give some of his knowledge away and keep some? Is that God likely? Is that a God? God is the difference between God in heaven and Jesus who was on earth. So when he was on earth, yeah. he, he made him small to show the people how God is. Because when he come with his almightiness, yeah. the people don't can accept. So okay, but why? Okay. This was just okay. when he was on earth. So yeah. the God in heaven, the Father, yeah. he came as Jesus or he sent Jesus? He sent his son Jesus. Yeah. Okay. So we have God the Father. Yeah. He is sending someone else, which is Jesus. Yeah, they said the Father and the Son is one. You don't can say it's okay. like uh, so then, very different. Okay, it's, so then the Father... He sent a part from him okay, to the earth. One second. Are you saying now God went into two parts? He is he has God, Son and Holy Spirit. Okay, so, so the Father. The, who did the Father send? Did he send himself? Or did he send someone else? Or did he send a part of him? like a part of him but you don't so, describe so, him exactly because it's like a mystery from God okay but, but does that make sense to you honestly? yeah so God having another part and then he's sending the other part to earth yeah. but that part is not him because he's in heaven but that part is his son but it's also divine and him and also he doesn't know the hour and he was killed on the cross yeah. does that make sense to you yes can you explain how that makes sense to you? Like, like how does it, how does, because we believe yeah. God is one. Yeah, God, okay, okay. God does not have another God. He's the all-powerful. His power doesn't diminish. He doesn't give his power away. He's always the all-knowing. He's not a man. He didn't claim to be a man. He can't be a man. Because this is the creation. This is finite. How could an infinite, all-powerful, all-being, God, leave his powers? Which is an impossibility because how could God leave his powers? And then he comes to earth. And he can do all things. He can also okay, can leave something of you in heaven and come to okay, earth. Can, okay, then can we say, can God become a jacket? A what? A jacket. That's not the same. Because it, Why not? Because uh, when God made human, yeah. he made human like the... Uh, I don't know the English word, like the like like built, like the mirror, like, like, like he created like, the man in his own image. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so but, he can come because he made him in his own image, but he don't can come in a jacket or something. Why, like okay, why not? Okay, tell me why can God come as a human, but he cannot come as a jacket? Why not? What's why not? Like I, I'm trying to understand because you said God can become anything. But now you say, no, he can't become a jacket. So why why you say God can become a man, but he can't become a jacket? Why? Because do, do you not believe that we are belittling God by saying he can become a jacket? Don't you think we are insulting God if we say God became a jacket? If I said to you, my God is a jacket, would you not laugh at me? You don't laugh, you are. No, 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 no. If I say to you, my God yeah, yeah, yeah. is my jacket, would you say to me, this makes sense? No, that makes okay. no sense. So what but a jacket is very different than a man. As a and a man is very different oh. than God. So when you say a jacket is different than a man, you're right. A man can do certain things a jacket can't. However, God is more magnificent. God is more supreme. God is more powerful than a man. Yeah, a man is weak. A man can die. Like Jesus died on the cross. Jesus was hungry. Also, he died, he went to heaven. Okay. His body died. No yeah. problem. But what I'm saying is, why, does, why do we claim that uh, Jesus is God when he himself, very himself, as a human being, he, he had no attributes of God. He had nothing he that has. could make him God. What did he have of God? Uh, he could heal people with yeah. the power of God. Jesus, uh, uh, Moses opened the sea. Yeah, with the power of God. Yeah, I don't say that other people that also can do it. Okay, so but, does that make them good? But what he was, uh, uh, 
special was that he don't make any sins, any mistakes. So Moses make mistakes. We, we, and, well, we believe Jesus, for example, he called a woman a dog. Huh? He called a woman a dog. Yeah. Yeah. So now, when we say that, just because somebody doesn't sin, we believe the prophets are sinless. You don't understand the scripture. It's not but, that he mentioned him, uh, her, a dog. He did. He, he said. Did. He said. He it said was like a, a image for the Jewish people that he come first for the Jewish people and afterwards no, no, for the know Gentiles. That. We know that, but, but it's not that he said she's a dog. But just because he somebody, didn't say that. just because somebody is sinless, doesn't mean they're a god. Is God's only attribute that he's sinless? So if somebody comes no, and is not only, so can, but I, I just give you one example okay, but so, that he is God. Okay, so if but how does that make him God? If a baby is born, yeah, is sinless. Is that baby God? No. Why not? But he's sinless. I said just it's one attribute that we see that he is in his whole life. He is sinless. But, but, but I don't say it's the only one. There are more attributes. No, 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 no. no. But what? Okay, is he the all-powerful? Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. How did he die on the cross? Because he had all power, yes, but he gave it, he laid it down. But, but that doesn't make sense. Because he wants to save the people. But that doesn't make him God. If God is the most powerful... When an American president is have all the power, yes. but he can give his rights away to... to, to, to okay, and that's why he's not the, he won't be the po most powerful. Because to, if he can to help it, other people, okay. so no, no, but for God, it's his essence. His the powerful, the all powerful, the all knowing, is his essence. I can't take away my personality or my traits and be like, okay, bye bye. It doesn't work like that. God is the most powerful. He will yes. always be the most powerful. Yes. He's not going to say, okay, today I put my power in the washing machine. I'm not. I don't need my power today. It doesn't work like that. He's the most powerful. He you had it, say? but he don't use it. <laughs> no, but, but this is that. But I have to. Okay, leave. okay I'm sorry, 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 sorry. Nice, no, okay, nice, no, okay. I was just really have nice you, to. Have you read the Quran? Several passages, but not okay. the whole. Yeah. Give, give the give the Quran a chance, because okay. all the Quran is telling us is to worship God alone. Bible? I read it before I came to Islam. Yeah, I read it. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's very no problem. Have a nice journey. Have a nice. And it's journey. nice to speak you with, with your yeah. respect. No, no, hundred percent. We're just trying to have a dialogue. That's nice. Thank you very much, Joshua. Take care. Have a have a safe journey. Thank you. Take care. Okay guys, so we just had a little nice discussion, trying to dialogue with people, learn from each other, get each other thinking, learn from each other, inshallah, and that's what we did today, and that's what we're doing. Assalamu alaikum, until next time. Assalamu alaikum, wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.